Here they are for one and all The moments are about to call Come on and sit down here with me They're here for you on your TV They are the moments They are the moments So come with me, give me your hand I'll take you up to Moomin land You can fly just like a bird And sing the best song ever heard There were the Moomins 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 Snufkin has put up his tent on the riverbank. He likes being on his own and has decided to stay there until winter comes, happy and at peace with the world. Moomin loves to spend as much time as he can with his friend Snufkin. Snufkin? Snufkin? Where are you? He must have forgotten I was coming and gone off somewhere. How can he enjoy being here on his own? I'd like to be alone now and then, you know. Oh, silly. Let's go and explore. Let's leave it till tomorrow, Snork Maiden. But we said we'd go today. Yeah, we did too, Moomin. You are the one that said it, you know. Hmm, you did. I didn't. You did too. Oh, you must come. We're going to collect shells on the beach. Come on, it'll be fun. Oh, no. Where are you guys going? Oh, I envy Snuffkin. Oh, why? I just do. I wonder where Snuffkin has gone. I wonder if we'll ever find anything as exciting as the hat. Yeah, it was very special, that hat. Did you really throw it in the river? Yep. Mm, I wish you hadn't. It was much too dangerous to keep. Look at the horrible things it did to me. But what about the eggshells it turned into clouds? Yeah, it was good fun flying around. Perhaps I'll find an oyster with a huge pearl inside. There, Snork Maiden, just a bit further. Help me, Sniff. Give me your hand. Hurry! Look out! It's the oh! ant lion! Look what you're doing to my hole. I'm sorry. I'll be out soon. Stop yelling and kicking like that. You're scaring off my prey. Are you all right, Snork Maiden? I can't reach her. I don't have to have ants for lunch, you know. Help me, Moomin, please. You better get in there, Sniff. What, me? Don't worry. I'll hold on to you. You're the only one tall enough, Sniff. Come on, You look quick. nice and tasty. I'll eat you instead. <laughs> Quickly, Sniff. Look, I... Get in there, you big wimp. Don't you call me a big wimp. <laughs> Are you ready? Hold tight. Oh. 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 That's 
Skin. That's a big secret, Moomin. I won't tell anyone. All right. It's the magic hat. It's on a sandbank further down the river. Oh, gosh. But something terrible is happening. What? What is it? Oh, dear. Perhaps we shouldn't have thrown it in the river. It's too late now. Let's get there quickly. It is. It's caught on a branch in the middle. Where? Oh, Snufkin, I can see it. Look at the water. It's all red. Hmm. Seems to be coming from the hat. I wonder what it is, Moomin. I'll go and get it. Be careful. <gasps> Shall I come too? No, you stay there. Have you got it? Uh-huh. What should we do with the hat? Well, I don't think it's a good idea to leave it lying around. Somebody might crawl into it. But if we put water in it, we can have as much raspberry juice as we can drink. Well, that would be nice. But you know, Moomin, it could only be river water that does that. You know what I mean, Moomin? Well, I think it's worth experimenting. Tired. I woke up in the night and couldn't get back to sleep. Ha! Pardon? Couldn't get back to sleep. Ha! What are you talking about? I was awake last night, too. And I know why you're so tired. You must have been dreaming. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm in a hurry. Thanks, Mama. Where are you going, Moomin? Moomin! Somewhere you can't come. Somewhere private. So, what was that all about, huh? Oh, nothing really important, Moom and Papa. I think I'll go out. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> nobody hides anything from little Mai. Hey, I found out whose hat it is. Whose? The Hobgoblins. The Hobgoblins? Yeah. I asked Sir Hemulin and he told me that he saw him once, long ago, wearing the hat. I heard about the wizard who flies in the sky. Yeah, on the back of a black panther. The Hobgoblin is hundreds of years old and cares only for rubies. He rides all over the world searching for them. He's truly awesome. And so when he dropped his hat... He must have been looking for some rubies right here in Moomin Valley. Do you think he's got a lot of hats, Snufkin? Gee, I don't know. Well, do you think perhaps he doesn't know where he dropped his hat? Yeah, I suppose that's possible. Snufkin, there's something I would like to try with the hat. Just don't put it on, will you? He's in there somewhere. Ant lions are pretty stupid, you know. Yes, Moom and Papa told me it takes them hours to dig themselves into the sand. Oh, no, it doesn't. It only takes them one hour. Only an hour? You're kidding. Well, of course, an hour is a long time to spend digging. Are you talking about me? Yes, 
about how quickly you could dig yourself into a hole in the sand. A lot quicker than you think it'll take. Moomin here says it takes you only one hour to dig a hole in the sand, but I can't believe that. Huh. Snuffkin says it takes several hours, but I think he's wrong. I'll show you how long. Gosh, that was rather fast. Yeah, but it's obvious he's already got a ready-made hole hidden there. Don't you, Antlion? No, I do not. I can dig myself in anywhere, anywhere at all. Where? How about here? Yeah, okay. Under this rock. All right? Anywhere. Just show me. Okay, start from here. Yeah, just there, if you don't mind. All right, start counting. Ugh. Wow, you only took a second and a half. He's really something, isn't he? He certainly is. I'd better sit on it. <sighs> yeah, he'll be really mad. So you've caught the ant lion. I've been watching. Little boy. Right. Did you follow us last night? Yes. Oh, did you tell the others? Oh, don't be silly, you guys. I haven't said a word yet. But you will if we don't let you join in with us. That's what she's doing, Moomin. No, as if I do such a thing. Of course, I'm forgetting how nice and kind you are. Hey, what is that? No, no hat anywhere. There's gallons of water. Gosh, there sure must be a lot of sand in there. He must have changed into something else by now. Probably. It must have been long enough. I'll jump off. He isn't strong enough to move the rock by himself. Shall we help him? No, don't! Come on, let's do it. Uh. What's happened to him? Let's turn it over. Oh, no, I can't look! Uh. Oh! It's a hedgehog! 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 Moomin, I just saw the hobgoblin. What? It must have been him. Do you think he was looking for his hat? I'm afraid so. I hope you hit it well. The cellar. Will it be safe there? Well, only little Mai and us two know where it is. I wonder if it's possible to change it into spaghetti. Huh? <laughs> mm, not 
not exactly spaghetti. Mama! Mama! There's something I think you ought to know. What is it, dear? There are strange things happening in the house. In the house? There's a tree in the cellar. A tree? That's nice. What did you say? A real tree? Yes, and it seems to be growing and growing. What have you done, little Mai? Just dropped a bit of thread into the magic hat. But Moomin threw it away. Yeah, we did, but we sort of found it again and put it in the cellar. Oh, dear. We must tell Moomin, Papa, before it's too late. Come in. It's not locked. Keep going, tree. You can grow as big as you like. And just tell me if you're thirsty or anything. And how about some fruit soon? I really like pears. Come in. I'm very sorry to disturb you, Papa. Mm, what is it? Well, it's not good. What do you mean, not good? I think you'd better come down and have a look at once, so you can see for yourself what's happening before it's too late. Too late? Oh, that sounds a bit ominous. Don't worry, I'll sort it out, whatever the catastrophe. Now listen, you. You leave my husband's desk alone or you'll be sorry. All right, dear, I'm coming. <gasps> oh, this is definitely a catastrophe. I think you'd better get me a saw, Mama. Oh, 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 oh. Everything's in the cellar and it would be a bit difficult to get in there now, Moomin Papa. Well, never mind. We haven't got time. I'll break them by hand. <laughs> Catastrophe is going on too long. Oh, I'm hungry. Oh. Look on the bright side, Papa. It could be a long time before we run out of firewood. There, take that. Oh, oh, that'll teach you to try and take over Moomin House. Papa, look at all these lovely flowers. And fruit. Oh. Uh, uh. Papa, Papa, you must try some. Oh, they're lovely and juicy. Oh, no! Little Mai must have put something into the hat. can't get out. We'll need some saws and axes. They must all be in the cellar, and we can't get in this way. We must try and find another way. All right. I'll run and get some help. You do not have to, little one. <gasps> Are you the hobgoblin, sir? I am he. I can see that you have found my hat. Yes, sir. It was on top of the mountain. I thank thee. That tree seems to be doing remarkably well. However, away with thee! Oh my! Oh goodness me! I oh! <laughs> oh my! Oh dear! <laughs> Oh, 
that really is some hat you have there, Mr. Hobgoblin. I'm sorry I troubled you. We're just glad you came along when you did, Mr. Hobgoblin. You are most kind, madam. I, I don't suppose you'd have any uncommonly large rubies here, would you? You finding my hat here must be an omen. Here you are, Mr. Hobgoblin. My husband, Moomin Papa, gave it to me. Mm. It is fine indeed, and you are lucky to have it, but I'm afraid it is not the King's Ruby I am looking for. What do you mean, King's Ruby? I have searched for it for hundreds of years, Moomin Mama. I'm afraid I am obsessed by it and cannot find it anywhere. Well, if we see it, we'll light a signal fire. You are most kind, madam, and I feel we shall meet again soon. He's not bad for a hobgoblin. Come on, everybody. Let's start stacking up all this wood. Okay, yeah, let's, let's do it. Do it. Um, <laughs> oh, whoops. <laughs> And so the hobgoblin's hat finally disappeared from Moomin Valley. Moomin rather missed having a never-ending supply of raspberry juice, but his parents were more than happy that it had gone. They love the laughter and they love the living, the Moomins. Believing and sharing and caring and giving, the Moomins. They're always happy and always at play The Moomins are having fun day after day The Moomins The Moomins They love the laughter and they love the living The Moomins Believing and sharing and caring and giving The Moomins They're all happy and always at play the moons are having fun day after day the moon